get out, get out, you can't be in here. Hi, welcome to another Windows tutorial. Today we're going to look at how to install Windows Server 2003. So to get started, insert the Windows Server 2003 CD into your into your CD drive and restart the computer. When it's loaded you'll see a blue screen that says Windows Setup. You can already have the prompts down the bottom of the screen. OK, when prompted press Enter to set up Windows. Press F8 to say you agree with the end user license agreement. Press Enter to install Windows Server on the hard drive selected. Select NTFS file system. Wait for it to format. Okay, now wait while the files being copied. OK, when prompted, press return to restart the computer and carry on setup. OK, now Windows has restarted, it's starting to install any devices in your computer. And after this, it will ask you to enter language information for the keyboard and system. OK, now it's finished installing devices. Click Customize to change the standards and formats used. If you're in the US, you can leave it as it is, but because I'm in the UK, I have to change it. Click Apply and OK. And then change the keyboard layout. Once again, if you're in the US, you can leave it. But because I'm in the UK, I need to change it to United Kingdom. Click Apply and OK. Now click Next, type in your name. and an organization if you need it. And click next. If you don't know, this is usually just fine as it is, so just leave it. Give the computer a name. and set administrator password. Make sure this is quite strong. And click next. Give to computer time zone. And click next. And wait for it to install the network components. OK, now it's done that. Click Next to accept the typical network settings. Make sure No is selected. This computer is not a network. Click Next.
Okay, now this bit, there's not really much for me to say because it's just the computer doing stuff now. So I'll leave the running. I'll leave this running, and I'll edit so you're not seeing through the whole thing. And I'll come back when it's done. Okay, now setup's finished, you'll restart your computer. If you see, press any key to boot from CD, ignore it. Okay, now the computer is ready. Press Control Delete to log in. And now wait for your settings to be applied. Okay, before we carry on, if you see this little balloon bump from the screen that says your display settings are too slow, click on it and click yes and then click yes again. Click off the start menu and because this is Windows Server 2003 R2 we're installing you have to just install these final components so click next click next and wait for the files to be copied okay now it's done click finish and just follow this page through. That's it for this tutorial and next one we'll be doing installing Active Directory, DNS and DHCP. So thanks for watching, look out for the next one coming soon. Get out, get out, you can't be in here.